Carlos Alcaraz versus Daniel Medvedev is a semi-final in Beijing for 2024. And both players have had good roads to get to this stage. Medvedev entered the tournament as the number three seed and will take on Monfils in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-4. In the second round, he take on Manorino. And after a close first set, we'll get through in straights. 7-6, 6-2. In the quarterfinals, he take on Caboli, who have been very impressive over the last few months. There's no problem from Medvedev again getting through in straights. 6-2, 6-4 to advance to the semifinals. Alcaraz entered the tournament as the number two seed and will take on Piracar in the first round. And after a couple of close sets, would get through 6-4, 6-4. In the second round, he take on Greek Spore. This is no problem for Alcaraz getting through in straights. 6-1, 6-2. Quarterfinals, he take on the number seven seed, Hashinov, a man that he'd never lost a set to in his career. And after a close first set, Alcaraz would again get through in straights. 7-5, 6-2 to advance to the semifinals. These guys have played seven times before with Alcaraz winning five out of the seven times, including the last three times, twice this year, one in Indian Wells and once at Wimbledon. The last time Medvedev actually won was last year's US Open in that semifinal. So if Medvedev is going to win this one, he's going to have to really get off to a good start and play better than he has over the last couple of months. If Medvedev is going to win this one, he's going to have to serve well and he's going to have to limit the errors. We've seen over the last couple of months, before the US Open especially, he didn't play great. Also the Labor Cup, he didn't play like himself. So he's going to have to get a lot of big serves in also just defend like crazy because we know what Alcaraz can do when he does play Medvedev, especially on a slower court. If Alcaraz is going to win this one, he needs to just keep doing what he's doing. He's been so good this week, almost perfect this week, especially the way he's played these bigger servers. You know, Hashinov, Pirikar, and Grigsport all have big serves. He's been returning so well as well, and he's going to have to do that against Medvedev if he's any chance of winning. What a great matchup to have in a 500 event. Two of the best players on the planet, Alcaraz number three, Medvedev number five, but I have to go with Alcaraz in this one in straight sets. I reckon Alcaraz is just going too good right now, and I don't know if Medvedev can hang with this level that Alcaraz has got at the moment. But let me just know what do you think is going to happen in this one?